Hi guys, Steady Eddie here, out on the mean streets of Udon Thani, Thailand. Well, I'm really getting to like this town after a couple of weeks, and I have to say I've found a couple of good little hotels. The one that I've been staying in for the past week is, is called The One Residence, and it's a rather good hotel. So, I'm here to do my little review of it. See what you think. It's another very central hotel, just about three or four minutes away from the central plaza. Greetings! Here I am outside of the One Residence in Udon Thani, and this is a fine hotel. It's the second hotel that I've stayed in this town and it's a very very reasonable price for a very nice room so I'll, I'll show you the room this is the reception area here okay so this is the reception area here and this this hotel is quite close to the town uh, just just a few minutes walk to central plaza so anyway here we go now this is the door there is no lift elevator with this hotel. Anyway, here's the ladies here. Here's the ladies, how are you? Okay, nice ladies. Okay, thank you, thank you, thank you. They're the maids, they are. They're the maids. Okay, so bear in mind, there's no lift here, so you will have to walk up these steps. You know, I was dragging that large suitcase of mine up here the other day. So, it is what it is. Anyway, okay, so this is the room. And if I stand over here in the corner, you'll see the size of it. It's, well, it's not a massive hotel room, but it's a fair size. In fact, I would say that as hotel rooms go, this, this is probably the perfect size. You know, those who watched the previous hotel that I was in, another video, will know that the bed was on a platform. And I, it was a bit awkward getting off and on it. But anyway, this is, it's a nice comfortable bed. And you step out of the bed, just the ideal amount of space to walk around. It's, it, it's the perfect size, this room. So... On, on that, on that uh, level, it's, it, it's a winner already. Now, with this room, you've got a kettle. Yes, they don't supply coffee, but it's nice to have a kettle. They supply a couple of bottles of water a day. There's no breakfast included with this room. But I'm just, um, just going to stand over in this corner just to get, give you another idea of the scale of it. Because like you say, this is a very comfortable room, this is. And it's just the perfect size, really. It really is. It's a very, you know, it's the kind of room that you can stay quite a long time in. It's got a nice big fridge. Uh, a nice big fridge. Very, very efficient. The air con is at just the right temperature. I've never had to alter that at all. There is no safe in the room. But there is a rather nice little cupboard space here for all your luggage. There you go, plenty of room there. And of course it's got a TV. If you use TVs in this day and age, I, I don't. It's got a phone if you need to contact reception. And it's got a rather good, very spacious bathroom. There you go, very spacious bathroom. Everything works, that should work, very efficient. Just about the right size. Nice little chair there, whatever you want to call it. Uh, if, you, if you want to park yourself on there with your laptop to do a little bit of work. There's a little balcony uh, out there. So there's the view from the window. Little balcony there. It's not really big enough for any table and chairs. There you go. Oh, and by the way, you've got a 7-Eleven 
uh, right in the other side of that building there in front of you. So um, 7-Eleven is very, very close if you need it. So what else can I say about this room? Um, it is the perfect size. It's very, very clean. Do you know what? In the week that I've been there, I haven't come across one single mozzie. Um, I haven't been bugged by one mosquito or anything like that. Maybe because I leave the, you know, the windows and doors closed. But it's very, very safe and, and uh, secure. And the only downside to it is that the Wi-Fi here is very hit and miss. Sometimes it's good and sometimes it's a struggle. And that's all I'll say. I mean, the previous hotel room I was in, that, that's, the Wi-Fi there was perfect, but that was probably the best thing you could say about it. So, like I say, this is a really good uh, 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 room. Um, only It's very close to the town. It's clean, it's spacious, it's got a kettle, it's got a fridge. Uh, it hasn't got a safety deposit box. The, the Wi-Fi is a bit hit and miss. But all of this for the bargain, bargain price of 600 Thai baht per night. 600 Thai baht for a nice, comfortable double room like this. And for that reason, being it's so nice, I, in fact, I actually would have stayed longer in this, uh, uh, in this hotel. Only when I tried to book it for another few days, um, they, uh, they, they booked up. It, was, it wasn't possible. But I'm staying for a full week in this hotel here. And it's really, really good. It's nice and comfortable. And it definitely, definitely gets the Steady Eddie seal of approval. Well, I hope you enjoyed that video. I hope it was useful to you. And another thing that I've really, really uh, been impressed with in Udon Tani is I've found myself a couple of really good eateries. They're uh, places where I'm guaranteed a decent meal. And uh, that makes all the difference for, uh, for me. So more of that later. Plenty more videos to come. And in the meantime, I'll say thanks for watching. Uh, subscribe to this channel if you haven't already a big thanks to those who already have and i'll be back with more videos very soon cheers what can i say bloody good